hey guys welcome back to my channel i'm tt and into this video we're gonna be talking about bullying being a coping mechanism so for me what i feel like a bully is it might be different to other people i feel like a bully is just somebody who's just very intimidating or they try to be intimidating just to like lower other people's self esteem lower their confidence and everything that, that's how i think a bully is and that's how i think they behave so that's just my own definition but other people might have different definitions people who bully people nine times out of ten they're insecure there's no secure person who wants to like shatter another person confidence because it's like if i'm secure i want the people around me to be secure a person who got confidence there's nobody outside like that's triggering anything they got that confidence that they can walk in any room they care less about who's there they care less about what other people say that's just how they are so if you're really confident and you got this type of high self-esteem and trust me you're not gonna want to make other people feel less it's like i'm just living my life i'm just being me a bully they want to make other people they want to they want to be recognized so bad they crave attention so that's why they pick on certain people most people that they pick on those are the easy targets most people who bully people they just do it from a place of insecurity that's just it they're just insecure they're not comfortable in their own skin they, there are certain things that they will project on you that they that they themselves have but they want to feel good about it by putting it on you so it's just so insane like they just i feel like anybody who bullies someone they're just insecure because if you're secure you won't do such a thing another thing is the fact that most of them they just want to feel most of them is just about the friends that they're around. Some people, they actually have that stuff instilled in them. They're just naturally mean and just disgusting. The attitude is just thing like very, very nasty. But they have some people who they are not like that. But because of the type of friends or the type of crowd that they want to be like affiliated with, uh, those type of people who want to bring other people down. So you joining in now, you, you just want to fit in. You just want to follow the crowd. But most of the things you're doing is not really of your own will. You're just doing it because of the people who you're around so majority not majority but most okay most of the people who bully people sometimes it stands from the people they're around it's not actually like their own will to do it they're just doing it because they want to fit in yeah one thing i've noticed is the fact that people sometimes people will bully you because of this secret competition that they have in their own head it's like without even your knowledge you don't really know nothing about this person you're not thinking of them but they, they have this secret competition in their head so they're just trying to like push it to you you know how sometimes it's like maybe if you have something and then people will be like oh my god like this is just an example like that stuff is not cute like i would never see myself like i would never see myself wearing such a thing but deep down it's like they either want what you have and they can't get it or they want what you have and they feel like it won't look good on them or because they've talked about it so much they feel weird having they feel weird having it so yeah it's just a secret competitive thing that a lot of these bullies have they'll know that you got something that they want but they don't want to admit it because it's gonna like tarnish that little image that e that ego or whatsoever they have going on so right now they just gotta play along because they'll be it be the, the prettiest girls like the girls who are that the girls who are like the eight girls basically but you'll see a lot of people a lot of people hating on them they're not ugly there's nothing wrong with them but people just hate them why because it's like i'm not like you like i just try to be like you so bad i can't do it so a lot of times bullies they they want what you have they love the they love the way you present yourself and everything so they just want to have a problem with you so they can start a friendship because you know after you have a problem with someone then you guys get to talk and all those things they don't want to come to you direct so they want to use that bully or whatsoever as an excuse or as an excuse to maneuver their way into your life bullying is just a coping mechanism for a lot of people because it's like they don't feel good in their own skin they don't feel good about themselves because why like a normal human being who got self-respect and like you're just a normal human being why would you come in why would you want to bully another person because at the end of the day from what i know it's like there's nobody better than anybody like you could do things that's better but there's no human being who's placed on this earth to be like exceedingly great compared to other people no it's either there's one person who work hard and there's one person who lazy but god didn't put a certain group of people to be hired so for me the people who accept bullying and all those things you just gotta understand like yo i am who i am and i'm myself for a reason you get because 
I see it a lot of times. Like, okay, so this is not the topic, but a lot of dark skin girls, like girls who are darker in shade, they feel so inferior sometimes to like light skin girls because of what society thinks. That's just it. Because a lot of dark skin girls, they are comfortable in their own skin, but then when it comes to like society and all those things, it's just so weird because people. People just make this a oh, bad statement. Everything is like, oh, you're so beautiful to be a dark skinned girl. Like, what do you mean by that? Like, dark skinned girls can be beautiful. Like, sometimes I don't understand certain things. And it goes to a point of having higher, like, opportunities in society. Like, whole lot of other stuff. And it's just draining for people. People have this thing where they body shame girls. Like, they will body shame girls. Maybe if your stomach is a little bit big or maybe... If you're not the shape, like the BBL shape, everybody want to like talk about. And it's like, damn, what am I doing wrong? Anybody who's been like affected by bullying and stuff is like, trust me, there's no, there's no better you than you. And that's just it. There's no better person who can like fit in your body. There's no better person who can fit in your skin. There's no person, there's no better person who can do what you're doing already. Because anybody who tried to shame you, who tried to, um, discourage you from what you're doing especially if you know you're not doing something wrong trust me they are the problem like you're beautiful you're smart you're kind you're wise and you yourself like work on yourself to the point where nobody else is going to make you feel less than yourself look in the mirror every day tell yourself like yo i'm way too beautiful i'm way too gorgeous like i'm here for a reason imagine if god can create you like huh you are the chosen by the man himself. So you're about to allow another female to come and bring you down. It makes no sense. So you guys, that's just it. I just want to talk, chat with you guys a little bit. And yeah, I will see you in the next video. Thank you for watching.